just try working from my foot. That's on my right, my foot and my back, my lower back. Okay. And on my shoulder. Okay. Okay. That's on the one that I need to work working on it. Okay. How long have you been having that low back problem? I think uh, for my child, I have like three years. Mm -hmm. My foot is two years. My back, I think about four years. Okay. That's how they follow me. Fill us in. Um, what happened to that foot over there, the left foot? My foot slid down, slid, and I twist my, on my, le my leg, mm -hmm. my foot, and that's when they get a little crack on it. And then they went to the doctor, but I still have it like, you no, know, probably when I walk. So I just want to clarify, so you fractured a bone in there. Yeah. So what did it, what you had done for it? They went to the doctor and put a boot, you know, they kind of boot it. Oh, gotcha. That's what they did. They could don't put out the, what do you call the waste of the... The cast, you mean? The cast, yeah. Don't put out the cast, just the boot. Oh, okay. That's why I think don't go and take it. My foot don't go the right position. Okay. okay. This is what normal supposed to look like. Nice and straight. Okay. okay. Does that look straight to you? No. All right, because everything's curving, just going up, yeah. right? So why is that? Well, I identified one major structure on the malady and a secondary minor. So the major one is this one right here. This is the fifth okay. lumbar over here. Okay. So what happened is in this case over here, this bone, okay, it went backwards and inferiorwards. Okay. I got you. When it's normal, you see how stable it is. Yes. Little movement. Okay, that's what it's supposed to be doing. But when it's knocked out of a line like this, there's a lot of movement on this fellow over here, okay? It's not supposed to move this much, no. not like this. All right. Okay? No, it's very unstable, see? Yeah, Normal. Gotcha. And let's say Abnormal, okay? Way too much movement. So that's why you feel all the uh, things going on from the, from the waist the upwards. Up. All because this is unstable. Okay. So that's the one we need to correct on you, okay? The second one, okay? I'm going to take a closer look at this fifth dorsal vertebrae over here, okay? Number five. Five, okay. So this fellow over here, okay, that innervates part of the muscles for the rhomboid and your shoulder blade, so on and so forth. So I wouldn't be surprised, okay, that right shoulder problem you've been complaining about, okay, will be helped a great deal when we correct this structure over here. This is what I see in your left foot, okay? okay? So now, what I'm going to take a look at is this. I want to see everything nice and leveled, okay? It's not. It's not like Okay. This talus over here, what it did was, instead of being here, you rotate and swing upwards. Yeah, but that was when I twist, when that happens, like maybe they can happen. Well, that's that's what the other x-ray is showing as well. See, on this x-ray over here, what happened was, it showed that over here, it actually had that inversion injury, what you're talking about before, okay? So that's why you, that's why when you had that inversion injury, meaning you rolled on the outside of your foot, exactly, you injured it, okay? And you knocked out this one over here, way out of alignment, because we see this significant gapping down, over here. Right down. You got it. Gapping over the top over here, narrowing over here. So this one over here, that's in trouble. Okay? That's what it comes from. Exactly. Gotcha. And uh, <clears throat> so this is the one we need to correct on you for this gotcha. one. Okay. Yeah, there's a chronic nerve right here, so that's what we need to correct. All right, so as we see over here, okay, there's a lot of swelling right in this region right over here. Okay, it's supposed to be nice and smooth like this, and then we see a raised indentation right over here. So I'm going to take a closer look. We'll see what's going on in that fellow over here. Yeah, we have a lot of pooling right over here, right. so. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm going to stand up. That's what they stop bothering me. Okay, how about right here? Tender? Yeah. Yeah, that's the fifth lumbar right there. Oh, no, okay. okay, so let's go, let's take a look. Yep, it's stuck. So that's yeah. the one we need to correct on. Like that. See, it's very tight oh, over like here, that, yeah. it's loose over here. Okay, got some pooling right over here. Not not a whole lot because this is chronic, it's been there for a very long time. Yeah, that's what I'm so, so chronic, <clears throat> for a chronic type of misalignment for this one over here, it's not gonna pull as much, but it's definitely there. See, this one's yeah, nice yeah. and smooth, yeah. but over here, see, just boggy right over here. And we push it forward, feel that fellow right there? Yeah. It's just stuck, it's just not moving. That's your fifth dorsal right there. Yeah. 
Fill me in, what's different now? No, my back I can feel it's like, okay, if I feel like bent like this, mm -hmm. now I can feel it's under. So close in, what's what's going on at that right shoulder? My right shoulder, she goes this way right here, doesn't get a pain. Mm. That's get a pain right here. Mm. And that's bottom here. And if oh. you squeeze like this, you can hear a little noise, like you did, you, mm -hmm. you hear it before. Mm. That's what they have. Got it, okay. So. Here's the deal with this one over here, okay? okay. So we're gonna correct that fifth dorsal, restore some more nerve function into the shoulder. Okay. okay? Help stabilize and get it, this fellow over here working a lot better. Okay. Right? Let's go. Just let it go. Okay. 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 So right now we're gonna check your shoulder blade. Okay. Okay. So it's moving upwards and inwards with our problem. Upwards, no problem. Okay, so as as we just check for medial and lateral deviation, it's just fine. So you laterally deviates fine. Medially, it's fixated. So it's right now it's superior medial. And right now we're gonna pump this up, see if we need to correct it or not. Okay. There you feel this now? It's starting to loosen yeah. up. Yeah. Okay? okay? So that means we don't need to correct this fella. Okay. Now that because we restored that fifth the, yeah, right, thanks. exactly the fifth dorsal nerve. We start to get some more mirror yeah, function yeah. into the shoulder blade now. See this now it's moving up and yeah, down without a problem. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So this one. There's no problem anymore. Feel my back and went we're back. Yeah? Yeah, feel mm. like it's go back normal. Because if I feel like this, mm. like bend it. This can feel good. How's the shoulder now? It's still like a little still like a little pain on it, but maybe it's because of just mm. do it right now. What else are you noticing that, that's different? I can push my father back. Okay. Yeah. That's good progress. Yeah. What else? Now I'm, I can feel my back like straight up. Okay, good. I can feel my back straight. So what problem do you still notice with that right shoulder of yours? Your right, not your left. No, I feel like it can go back all the way to the back and before the thing go, go to. Got it. Like Got go it. right, right okay, here. So we'll take a closer look on this one. No, just like relax. That. No, just relax your shoulder. Right now we're just checking your SC. AC is a little fixated. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. So you see that your scapula, your shoulder blades moving fine. Glenar humeral is not. Okay. So first things first, we're gonna set a bit of your AC. Just let it go. Let it go. Just let it go. Now it's moving better. Okay. Okay, just relax. Alright, let's set this over here. Just relax over here. Just relax. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I can hear. Okay, walk around. Good, that's good. That's good. It doesn't get pain anymore here. No, I have it. Let's say uh, right now I don't have too much pain because I don't work. So yeah, we work and be I'm coming here like tell you but uh, I hear you. How's the right shoulder now? I know, so a little good. It's more different when I, I push my arm like I did before, I can have pain. I feel like a little bone underneath my, my foot right here. Uh -huh. 
like a little something like have to try to push my my foot. Uh huh. Yep. So close in. How's that foot feel right now? What's different? The difference is I don't feel that that look, have something like bono on the knee. Okay. So I can push down. All right. Yeah, I feel good. Good. Anything else? No, just it for now. All right. Yeah. Okay. It's good. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, you're very welcome. Thank you. We're all set. Yeah.